We told you last week that McKinley Elementary School recently was named to the National Register of Historic Places. Those living in the neighborhood wanted to preserve the building. Q2's David Jay has more from a historian on the school's significance to Billings. The 1917 edition, which clearly is patterned after the 1906 original, John Gustav Link, who was one of Montana's great architects. Anton Jacobs, very well-known stone carver if you're from the Columbus area. But when they built the 2014 edition, this side right here, they did something to really try to distinguish the separation. Kevin Koistra, Western Heritage Center Executive Director, says the edition illustrates some of what was happening in Billings from 1906 to 1917. When this building was built in 1906, almost immediately the superintendent of schools was already saying, we got to build more. So the population really is driving the need for more space and more school. McKinley School's address is on North 31st Street. The school property takes up a whole city block, which also includes North 32nd Street, 8th Avenue North, and 9th Avenue North. And it's all within or next to a neighborhood that's on the historic places list. The North Elevation Historic District sits to the north here of McKinley, but the process for getting McKinley in the district happened, started about 14 years ago. McKinley School has clearly been the anchor property, along with, I would say, Pioneer Park, for the North Elevation Historic District, kind of in this area, for over 100 years. He says it's important to preserve historic buildings. The places that make us feel at home add an element of our deep history in a place. When our children or our grandchildren are going to McKinley School, there's these wonderful ties of who we are living in a place, and that's what really resonates for people. In Billings, David J. MTN News. Koistra says while many historic buildings are often repurposed, McKinley has always been an elementary school.